Okay, this is our garden so far. Um, this is July, so some of these things are already are already to uh, excuse if the dog is chasing chickens. Some of these things are already to harvest. Some of them aren't. Uh, the tomatoes are growing very well this year. Uh, pumpkins are going to do well. Strawberries, we replanted these strawberries, and so they'll be ready next year. Um, first thing you're going to notice when you look is we didn't weed anything. This is the first year we've tried this, but it's been very, very successful. And I'll tell you a couple things we get from doing this. Uh, number one, we don't have any slugs. If slugs are The slug problem is gone, and it's because everywhere they look they have something to eat they don't have to go to the vegetable farm. okay the other thing is when the harvest is done we'll just open this up to the chickens and they'll take care of everything that we need them to do and if they what they don't eat we'll pick and we'll give to the quail or we'll give to the rabbits so there's really no reason for us to to weed you know now this may offend some people who you know love a nice tidy little garden but Oh well, uh, you know, whatever. If that's your hang up, then whatever. Um, we've got a lot of things go. We've got beans and peas. We can't keep up with the peas. The peas are growing so fast, we can't eat them that fast. Uh, we've got lettuce and carrots. Uh, we've got broccoli. We've got, well, we'll walk over here. Dad wants to walk. Minerva! Minerva! Hey! Excuse her. Okay, Belle's going to tell you what else we got. What's this? Oh, this is kale and... No, not kale. This is cabbage, broccoli, and cauliflower. Okay. We've got cabbage here. Already again, this is June or July, I don't know, 12th, something like that. We've picked one. We already picked some. Minerva! Hey! Okay, this is, Beverly? That's um, fennel. This is fennel, and if she scans this, this grows wild. Okay, I don't know if you've ever tried fennel, but my goodness gracious. You can't, I mean, we don't even try to stop it. Um, the only thing that is not growing well is corn. We simply have a hard time growing corn in western Washington. Um, in between the corn is all potatoes, and the potatoes line the fence over there. You'll notice we've got peas growing up the fence. Um, what else have we got? The kale and kale. the fennel are the two things that are growing on their own. That'd Enough. be Bill telling Minerva to be quiet. She's yelling about something. <laughs> yeah, the, the kale just goes. I mean, and the other thing we like about this while we're on this subject is we have stuff growing that we didn't plant and we just love it. Um, let me show you. We have wheat growing. I just think it's so cool. I don't know why, but I do. Uh, tomatoes appear out of nowhere. Wheat. Uh, tomatoes. And yes. then we have a. Beverly, you have to take over here. We oh. have a wild. First lane, right here. If you can see it. Where? There, that's first lane, this right here. That grows wild. We got it from a friend's garden. Another random plant that's growing to seed. All, it's a salad or a lettuce. <laughs> it's a lettuce plant. It's going to seed. That was, just grew on its own. And again, this is the chicken hutch. This is the chicken run. Um, you probably already noticed we're kind of laid back here and we don't much care about you know better homes and garden so when we get done harvesting we'll open this up for the chickens they'll come in and take care of whatever we need them to do uh, we'll probably close that off at that time uh, we're not sure if we're going to garden that area next year 
on the hill is um, uh, what's that thing? Cherry called? tree stump. Yeah, it's a hygge culture. We're trying to culture. That's that was originally a cherry tree. Okay, we cut it down to the stump. We covered it with dirt. We keep throwing compost on it. And right now, if we wanted, we could grow vegetables. Okay, we haven't done that this year, but we that could easily be turned into vegetables. And so that's what we're doing. Um, the backyard then, if you scan that, Bev, the first third of this backyard will be quail, and then we'll have rabbit run, and then we'll have goats. And all across that far fence over there is raspberries, and we'll probably move the raspberries over to this area here. So uh, Otherwise, the goats are just going to eat it. And yeah, I know there's problems with goats, but we don't care. We want to raise them, so that's our story. Uh, you'll notice we've got a lot of things around here we can use. We've got bamboo still left over here. We've got lumber that we use and recycle. And I want to say that again, we've got lumber that we recycle. We don't buy new stuff. The only thing that we bought new really is the chicken fencing. Um, all the rest of the lumber, my God, we didn't buy any of this, Bev, did we? No. no. Lumber. This was all we found on the side of the road or whatever. So. <laughs> And we have also growing, here's some more of the wheat. And we have some lamb's quarters growing right here. That's wild. We're not taking that out of the garden. We do weed the, the raised beds. Um, not constantly, but we weed enough to let the plants grow through. There's a piece of a head of lettuce that <laughs> grew on its own. Um, the lamb's quarters and the purslane are really high in nutrients, so we're going to just let them grow. And we also have some eggplant over here that I'm excited about because I've never grown eggplant. Such a pretty uh, vegetable. And then we have our wild herb garden. Yeah, it's wild. We haven't done much with that. This year we didn't. This is the first year we haven't weeded that out. I mean, and we'll have to because eventually the weeds will take over, but the rosemary is still fine, the peppermint's still fine, all the mints are still fine because we use it in our water, so. And, uh, I don't know. Anything else, Beverly? Wild nasturtiums, which we eat in salads. We didn't plant those. Yeah, we've let a lot of things grow on their own. Because we had the where the the grains came from. I don't know. Yeah. So that's it. Um, until next time. This is Bill, Bev, and Minerva signing <laughs> off.